Hi, this is Yolanda Bryant. Welcome to Early Kinder Gators Online Preschool. Please join us for our free circle time Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 10 a.m. Follow us on Facebook and YouTube. Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Circle Time with Miss Bryant. I'm so happy that you're here today. And this is Early Kinder Gators Online Preschool. So, the first thing that we do in the morning is we get a paper and a pencil. Okay, and then I need you to write your first name down because we're going to look at the letter in your name, the first letter in your name, and what sound the letter makes. All right, you guys have your name written down in your paper and pencil? Good job. All right, so let's get started. Let's go over to the alphabet board. So I want you to listen for the first letter of your name, look for the first letter of your name, and listen to the sound that it makes, okay? Does your name start with A? A. Does your name start with B? B. Does your name start with C? K. Does your name start with D? D. Does your name start with E? E. And does your name start with F? F. And does your name start with G? G. Does your name start with H? H. Does your name start with I? E. Does your name start with J? J. Does your name start with K? K. Does your name start with L? L. Does your name start with M? M. Does your name start with N? N. Does your name start with O? A. Does your name start with P? P. Does your name start with Q? Qu. Does your name start with R? R. Does your name start with S? Does your name start with T? T? Does your name start with U? A. Uh. Does your name start with V? V? Does your name start with W? W? Does your name start with X? X? And does your name start with Y? Yeah. And does your name start with Z? Z? All right, boys and girls. So next, we're going to do the letter of the day. Okay, boys and girls, now we're going to do the letter of the day. Look what I have in my hand. Hi, this is a brown bear. Okay, this is a teddy bear. So our letter of the day begins in the word bear. Hmm. What letter is that? What sound do I hear in the beginning of the word bear? Hmm, b, b, bear. If you said B, you are correct. Yay! So, let's get a magnifying glass and look for the letter B. B, 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 B. B, there it is. Good job. So our letter of the day, guys, is the letter B for bear, brown bear. And this little girl has butterflies, five butterflies. B, B, B. Now I want you to get your paper and pencil because we're gonna get ready to write the uppercase B, which is the larger B, B, and the lowercase B, which is the smaller B, B. Okay, so get your paper and pencil. B. So the letter B has one line going down and two C's on it. So let me show you what I mean. So here's one line going down. You got your line? Good job. And then we're gonna write two backward C's, okay? Or half circles. One, two. There's the uppercase B, 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 B. Now we're gonna do the lowercase B, which is one line and a 
another half circle or C, okay? Backward C. So let's write that one line going down, okay? And a half circle or a backward C, okay? All right, good job. So remember, we have five days that we normally go to school and two days on the weekend that we stay home, okay? So we have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, which is seven days. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Good job. So now we're gonna sing our Days of the Week song, okay? Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. All right. So today's day is, today's day of the week is Wednesday. Starts with a W, W-W-Wednesday. So let's read our sentence. Today's day of the week is Wednesday. So let's take a look at our calendar. So here's Wednesday, okay? And today is the 21st. This month is July. So it's July the 21st, and today is Wednesday. Now, yesterday was Tuesday, and tomorrow is Thursday. But let's say the days again, okay? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And let's go ahead and count the days on the calendar. Ready? Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one. So today is July twenty first. 2021 on a Wednesday. All right, very good. Now, let's talk about the weather. Okay, so I want you to look outside your window, or if you're already outside, I want you to look up in the sky, look all around you. What does it feel like? Is it hot? Is it cold? Is the sun out? Is it raining? How is it in your neck of the woods? Well, let me tell you how it is in Houston. It is summertime and it's sunny and it's hot. So we're gonna look for that on our board. So let's go ahead and read our weather sentence. Today's weather is sunny and it is hot. H-O-T, hot. Okay, and now we're gonna go ahead and get Miguel dressed for today. So, Miguel has his little bed clothes on, but he needs some clothes, right? Now, what is he gonna wear today? Is he gonna wear a raincoat? No. Is he gonna wear a sweater? It's too hot for a sweater, right? No, but he can wear a nice short sleeve shirt or no sleeve shirt so he can stay nice and cool and some shorts so here's his green shirt and his green shorts and his shoes for his feet let's put his shoes on and then uh oh his other shoe fell hold on and then we need to cover up his eyes to protect his eyes from the sun rays. All right, Miguel is all ready for the day. All right, good job, guys. 
So now we're gonna go into our color of the day. So what's the color of the day? Day, day. What's the color of the day? Day, day. Woo. Okay, so let's look at our colors. What color is this, guys? Green. Can you give an example? I heard somebody say a green grasshopper. Good job. What about this one? Blue. Good, like a blue what? Ball? Oh, okay, good. What about this color? Orange, you're right. Orange, like what? What's something that's orange? Hmm. Maybe an orange fruit? You like oranges? Those are good. What is this color? Purple, you're right. What is something that's purple? Hmm, maybe a purple flower? And what is this color? Brown. Hmm. This color reminds me of something we saw earlier. Yes, the brown teddy bear, right? And what color is this one? Pink. Very good. Like the pink icing on that cake we saw the other day on Monday. And what color is this one? Yes, white, like her white bow in her hair. And what color is this one? Red, yes, yes, like his red shirt. And black, very good. I have black hair. All right, and the last one is Yellow, like the sun. So our color of the day, have you guessed it? Mm, if you guess brown, like the brown teddy bear, you are correct. So let's find brown and put brown right here. Okay, so I want you to look around your house today and see if you can find something that's brown. Okay. So now we're gonna go into our number. Okay, we're gonna go on to math. So let's go ahead and start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And I bet you're wondering, what are those circles and little squares on those numbers? Well, that is called a 10 frame. Okay. And the 10 frame has little circles or counters in them to represent the number. All right. And today's number of the day is five. Five. Some of you are five years old, right? So let's count. One, two, three, four, five. And look at here on our hand. We have one, two, three, four, five. So let me see you put up five fingers and count. All right, good. Let's do that again. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. So what I want you to do now is get your paper and pencil because we're about to write the number five. So here's a little boy. He is playing with five balls. So one, two, three, four, five. He has a green one, purple, blue, yellow, and red one. So let's put our five up here. And then we're gonna find our number five to put up there with it. Five. Okay, so now you should have your paper and pencil ready because we're going to write the number five. So let's put 
put the five in here. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and write our number five. So the number five is a little tricky. You might need some help from your parents with this one. So we're gonna do a line this way, a line across, a line going down, and then we're gonna do like a backward C, okay? A half circle. Ready? And we're gonna go like this. Five. Did you do that? Good job. Now we're gonna draw five stars. You may need help with your stars, but that's okay. All right, ready? One, two, three, four, five. All right, good job if you got that done. All right, let's count them. We have the number five, and we have one, two, three, four, five stars. Excellent. I can see your work. Good job, guys. All right, guys, that concludes our circle time. We have such a great time. I'll see you on Friday. Bye now.